Oh, we hunted something. Ah, yes, there it is. Oh, um... Can we rename people? Because you're fucking Jesus. Good work, Jesus. Good work. Old man Jesus hunting the Ibex Ram in the middle of the fucking river. <laughs> Just sits on top of it and magically strips it apart for, well, parts. Good work. I like how the cougar doesn't want to fuck with Jesus right now. Hell no. Hell no are we doing that. A crew is big and it keeps getting bigger. That's cause Jesus Christ is my What's up nerds? Welcome to Dawn of Man. This is my first attempt at, you know, reviving sort of a first impression series that I started forever ago. Uh, this is a sort of strategy simulation game. You play as a tribe in the early days of man and essentially you try and survive, expand, and thrive in the wilderness. And uh, we're gonna give this a shot. Ooh. So there's free play, challenges, and community created scenarios. We're gonna name this, uh, our, our settlement name is Valhalla. I sort of like the River Fork. Nomad. All right, let's, let's start with nothing. Nothing built. Just establishing ourselves for the absolute first time here. All right. So we need some places for us to live. This is actually a pretty all right place. I like this. But we're going to have to, uh... Figure things out. Can't zoom in much further than this. Personal preference, I would like to be able to zoom in and just stare at their faces, but hey. Get ourselves a hearth. All right, get us so some storage locations. So f sticks and stones may break my bones. Go one. I think about two tents ought to start us off nicely. Go one a crafter. I'm setting a bunch of stuff up. Uh, first, I'm gonna prioritize uh, the huts. When you micromanage everything, nothing is going to happen. You hold shift and you can make a couple of these. So we'll just have that be for skin drying. Okay. Um, we can set work areas to gather sticks, which we can then use. We can also set areas to obtain flint. Where the heck is flint? Not looking like there's much flint around here. We're gonna be a bit sparse on that. We'll have to set up to fish. You can fish all along here. Collect and harvest wild plants. We have a good amount of that right here. So we at least have that benefit. All right. So people sort of automatically go about what they need to. You can sort of micromanage. Like I can literally tell this one guy to do this thing. To get it from there instead. But otherwise they'll just sort of automatically do it and what they see as the most optimal way possible. And, as is most strategy games, we can adjust the game speed. Just bound to two, three, and four for the respective speeds, so we can speed this up a little bit. Get ourselves building. High priority are these. They'll say some stuff too, here and there. Um, we need a certain kind of tool to do that. All right, run into a problem, don't have much storage, so let's just build, no, no, no. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna build some more of the basic things that don't require any additional resources, so. And storage, rock pile. Put this right over here. Yeah, we're, I'm not really seeing much flint at all. Maybe it's across the, ah, there's some flint. Obtain flint over here, too. The flint is gonna be a bit more of a hike. But, we'll manage. Six times ten, knowledge plus one. Can't do anything with that, I don't believe. We need basic stuff first. Ooh, cool, you can get puppies. Can you, can you fucking pet the puppies, though? That is the question. Oh yeah, I need to adjust stuff. So... By default, it'll only set it to be one person at a time working on certain things, but you can 
set multiple people to do some of the things. So we'll just... So we start with a couple of kids. Little girl here. Ami. We have, uh, Kin. Oh, hello. So we can get right up in their face. We just have to sort of focus them. Hello, Kim. What are you doing? Not much, to be honest with you. Skins dryer all set, and the crafters all set. Awesome. So we have some skill points. We can learn to dry food, which is the first thing they had me do in the tutorial. Uh, spirituality, tanning. We can make better clothing. We can learn dog domestication. Isn't that right, Ella? I think we're going to go for food drying just because it is pretty important to have uh, like actual proper food. Alright, so we need to actually hunt too. So let us set up to tell people to hunt. So there's this vision. It's called Primal Vision and it lets you uh, see the wildlife around. Yeah, there's some stuff over here. Alright. Bone, raw skin, and meat have max quantities set. Alright. It's hard to see a lot of our camp just by proxy of uh, being behind the trees. Let's work on getting these skin dryers up because we're about to get some other stuff. I'm going to lower the maximum number of uh, simultaneous tasks for the sticks. And here, we're actually going to prioritize that instead. So we can get some actual hunting tools. This is the process of creating tools. Yes, it is quite well done. Sort of like that little fade in, fade out, but I wish it were a little bit quicker. Oh, we hunted something. Ah, yes, there it is. Oh, um... Can we rename people? Because you're fucking Jesus. Good work, Jesus! Good work! Old man Jesus hunting the Ibex Ram in the middle of the fucking river. <laughs> Just sits on top of it and magically strips it apart for, well, parts. Good work. I like how the cougar doesn't want to fuck with Jesus right now. Hell no. Hell no are we doing that. <laughs> Old man Jesus. Oh boy. Alright. Uh, hunting and gathering. Milestone. Game speed times four. Very important note. Milestone unlocked. Gives us two knowledge. All right, so these are automatically set for continuous production of dry skins. I would like to get this done. By that, pro by that I mean I need that done too. We're gonna unprioritize this. I want the skins dried, which takes a while. And then once we get four of them total, we can make the storage hut. Food dryer. All right, now we're gonna start drying our food, which will last longer as a result. Oh, so we got some more uh, knowledge. What shall we get? Ooh, slings for hunting might be an idea. So can we make them here? Yes, we can. I'm gonna try and get us to make two of them, preferably. Ah, you're thirsty, you're thirsty. So some of those status symbols are your current state. All right, I would like then to set hunting a little bit more priority. I don't think we can get stone yet. We have no means of like pickaxes and whatnot. So I'm just gonna remove that entirely for now. All right, and the fishing that we had set up. So this is, let's see, temperature, it's fall. So fishing is still plausible. A trader. Ooh. Hello. All right. Trader stock. You have. I want some of your dry skins. We got four four skins from the trader. Some of us have no warm clothing. Okay. Guess we need that back now. We'll use the skins in question to make better clothing. Go to the tent. Isn't there clothing in here? Ah, all right, so he is going to get his outfit. Good, that's what I wanted him to do. Oh boy. 
Is it winter? Yes, it is. All right, uh, where is the flint one? Because I'm pretty sure I still have that set to have a bunch of different spots. Oh, we hunted a reindeer. Cool. We definitely need to hunt more. Little kids are going to help bring things back home. The adults are probably going to keep hunting. It's their primary task. Is there anything specific? I need to do a little bit more micromanaging and tell these people, hey, I want you to hunt things, so we're going to have you hunt it. But first, I need to find something to hunt. Oh yeah, Primal Vision could probably help with that. We just need to find something huntable. Oh, you're already dead. Megaloceros. Yeah, there we go. Now we got some stuff brought in. We can research something else. Cool. Bone tools. Tanning. We can search dogs. We're still in the Paleolithic area, era, apparently. Um, it is winter. I think we should probably get some tanning done. Yeah, set up more of this. We actually probably should make another one. So, production. I would like a food dryer, a second one. You can set it right next to it. A couple more there. Food. Alright, so that's just showing our net food. Uh, animals. That's for, like, pets and wildlife. Uh, resources. We already got grouped resources. Okay. In general, workload chart. People haven't been doing as much, from the looks of it. Are wolves attacking? They're at exactly, I do not see. Oh, female. So far, she's got it. All right. You skin it. It's the first time we have quote-unquote hunted a wolf. You need some health, though. Excellent work. Wolf took the opportunity in the middle of the storm to do what it thought it must. Survived winter. Lovely. Gives us a knowledge point. I might like to get dog domestication underway. So we do have some bones, and we could make some of that. But, you know what? I would like some folks to take care of building these soon. If possible. We have the dry skins. I know we do. We've hunted, certainly enough. Alright, people are working on some stuff. We'll get another hut set up. Excellent. Excellent progress. Excellent. Getting more and more meat dried. Trader! I would like a log that has a one value. So in exchange, I will give you a fish. It's the one log I need to do this. Thank you. Run! No! Was she dead? She's just dead. Oh boy. That was quick. Oh boy, these cave lines are gonna kill us all. Can't let Jesus die. Not let Jesus die. Jesus must survive. Where is she? There she was. Aww. It was one of the young girls. They killed a child. Alright. We gotta build a monument for the girl. Memorialize the young girl. We lost. And we got two new people. Alright. Excellent! Excellent! Now we can start working towards this. Alright. We're getting bone equipment now. I want this to be prioritized and that to be prioritized. Uh, he's feeling better and more morale. Who's dying? Forgot to actually... Oh, that was easier. Yay! Dog dog did world! You helped! Oh, that's that's a bit of a fuck. Me. You need to just get 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 over here. Get out of there. Get out of there. 
go away from them. It's winter now. Great. Lovely. Hey, Trollock's actually doing well enough. He might actually win this. Oh boy, you barely survived that. Woo! Trollock! All right, traitor. What do we have that you might want? Want to get rid of those. I would like some stuff in exchange. How do you make this? What is this? Substance used to treat raw skins in order to make leather is obtained from the bark of some trees such as oaks and firs. Oh! Can only be done in spring. Okay. Can I set up a job for that? Yes, I can. Okay, that is very much useful to know. Ibex. Fifth Ibex that we've hunted so far. You have a bone spear, that's good at least. Run. Fucking run. Double time it. Double time it out of there. Yeah, we managed to save Ken. Yeah, truck. Truck to the rescue again. Oh, boy. I want to rename them. But then I'll get too attached when they inevitably die. We got leather outfits now. We have seven people. One, two, three, four, five, six more. I'm going to make an extra one. Yep. Assuming I get the chance. Oh, excellent. Leather outfit 10. We have 10 of them. Excellent, excellent, excellent. All right. So what does this require? Stone. Flint pick. All right. With that, the knowledge that we will soon have proper weapons, we are going to call it here. Thank you all for joining me for this. This has been Dawn of Man. Subscribe, like, all those other fucking things to feed the algorithm. And take care. Hey, no.